Hi, welcome back to Buona Papa. Today we're going to prepare a recipe that is perfect for picky eaters if they really don't like to eat vegetables because we're going to prepare turkey vegetables meatballs juicy and tasty meatballs turkey ones loaded with hidden veggies so that your little ones will be introduced to the flavor of veggies and you know slowly next time you can even give them the veggies only it's a slow and nice transition to introduce the vegetable world to your little ones this recipe it's super yummy my kids really really like it and with the time i was able also to increase the quantity of vegetables and the ratio meat vegetables and now i finally got into a one-to-one -one ratio so 50% meat and 50% vegetables. Also, you can prepare this recipe way in advance and simply freeze the meatballs and use them and cook them in 15 minutes on crazy weeknights. Let's start. First thing to do, in a food processor, I'm going to blend all the veggies into breadcrumbs consistency. I will start from the broccoli and the carrots. I use only the florets of the broccoli and I chop the carrots in big pieces. Then I'm going to blend the cauliflower florets and the kale. And for the kale, I'm going to use only the leaves. I'm going to get rid of the central stem because even if it's cooked, it's a bit too hard for little ones. Place the minced veggies in a large bowl and add the ground turkey. You can substitute the turkey with chicken or beef. I really like this recipe with the turkey. I think it's a nice balance. And as mentioned before, the proportion between meat and veggies should be one to one. So 50% veggies and 50% meat. It's time to add the almond meal, the chia seeds, and the chia seeds will act as a glue for our meatballs and we are not going to use eggs in this recipe. That's why I'm using chia seeds. The ham seeds and the ham seeds will offer an extra fuel for your kid's brain because they are loaded with omega-3s. I'm also going to add oregano, garlic, a pinch of salt, skip the salt if you're cooking for babies under 12 months, and some Parmesan cheese, grated Parmesan cheese. Mix everything together so that all the ingredients will be nicely combined. With your hands, create small bowls with one tablespoon of mix and coat every single meatball with panko breadcrumbs. At this point, you have three options. You can save the meatballs for future crazy nights, dinners, and simply freeze them like that in the freezer. You're going to cook them when we will need to enjoy them. Second option, you can bake them in the oven, simply place them on a tray, drizzle some extra virgin olive oil on top and bake them in preheated oven 400 degrees for 20-25 minutes. Or option three, the one that my kids like the most, you can cook them on the stove. And that's what we are going to do. Heat some olive oil in a pan, Add the meatballs and brown them for four or five minutes all around so that basically the meat will seal all the juices inside. Add the tomato sauce and the water. Reduce to simmer and cook for 15 minutes and you can turn the meatballs halfway. This is a super juicy, yummy and healthy recipe. It's kid friendly but it's also a lovely family meal. I really really hope you're going to enjoy this recipe. If you want to leave me comments please write them in the area here below. If you want to check more meatball recipe check the links in the area here below or here up here. Also for the ingredients and the full procedure the link to my blog is down here too. Also, if you want to check the ingredients list and the procedure, the link to my blog is here below. And most important thing, remember to subscribe to Buona Papa. It's totally free and you will receive every week a new recipe from me. <laughs> ciao, ciao, ciao!